Hey everyone, and welcome to Fallout 3, part 13. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay. Well, that was a good start. That was an excellent start. Oh god. <clears throat> Where I, uh... <laughs> Gotta check my hands straight away. Where did they even come from? Please go berserk. Please? Oh god, they did not, they did not go berserk. I'm gonna run into more of them, aren't I? I need- I need my things back. Okay. I think I can hit another one. Yes! You are critically hit. Are you not mad about that? No? No? You're not? You are not mad about that. Okay. No, you can stop then. Yes! No! Oh! Calm down! Attack your other friend! What is wrong with you? Attack friend. Yes, yes. Murder, yes. Exactly. That's what I mean. That's what I'm talking about. Exactly. How's the burning going? Is it is it is it going well? <laughs> <clears throat> I'm bantering with ants right now. So that's the thing. Obviously my dude's gonna lose. You know, they are very resistant to fire. That should not surprise me, but it does. It really does. Yeah? Okie dokie. In that case, we're gonna aim for your head. That'll do, right? Exactly, that'll do. Thank you for your fire and nectar. Stupid ants. I was going to say when we started. I'm going to inspect these houses, but you know, then I nearly died. So about that. Because one of them was a family and the other one was the doctors and I um, oh god, not another one. Yeah, another one. How are there this many? That boy was just zoning out. I'm actually gonna have to kill him like this. Actually, no I don't. I can run away from you, which I will. I will run away from you. And I will open the door to this instead. Ha! Huh. Suck on that, Ant. Suck on that. Oh, that is an expensive pack of cigarettes. And someone is playing music for some reason. You take your booze regardless. Ruined couch, yes, I bet. Oh, of course I'm over encumbered. That's like the first thing that happens. Oh god, I press all the wrong buttons. What am I gonna throw away now? I swear I need more strength. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna throw this away, aren't I? Yeah, I am. And I'm also gonna throw away um actually, wait, no. Maybe I can fix some things. Maybe I can fix you. Oh. Maybe I can fix you. I can fix you. Maybe I can fix you. I can fix you. Look at me fixing things. And having way too high I'm gonna Hello, use this instead. This and now that I've fixed everything, I suddenly have a ton of room. Let's talk about Why didn't I do that before? Because you couldn't. Okay then. Oh, and now I also have the wrong thing equipped. That is not what we use in these places. We use this. But first we'll take that away because we don't want anyone to get scared when they talk to me because I'm clearly a very nice person who just happens to collect guns and then shoots them at people but don't let that deter you it is my responsibility. why is this on w brandis's terminal and an empty suitcase uh william brandis's footlocker where where is this william brandis figure person Maybe this will tell me. 
when I hack the terminal like a true hacker. Bitten. Three out of six. That would... No, that wouldn't quite make sense. Wait, would it though? This would though. No, that's two out of six. Wait, if two out of six is correct on this, then it's just the T's that are correct, I guess. The T's or a B and T. Oh, I'm gonna ruin this so hard. Oh, God. The first one there were two, three correct, and the second one there were two correct, so... So it can't be B and B, B, T, T can't be it. So it has to be something else. So it also can't be battle. Because if that was the case, then B, T, T would be correct, which it isn't. Let's see, there's a T there and an A, E there. That one would actually make sense because then the T and the E would... Three out of six? No, two out of six again. Oh, God. Well, I only have one attempt left. I'm gonna die. You don't die from hacking terminals, Jinzy. Not if you've been to the real world. Exactly. Double T could still be... That could still be a thing. Which would mean that the... Oh, no, wait. You know what? I'm gonna try. I'm just gonna find a guy. And it's a match! Okay! I planned to do that. I did. Yes, I did. Brandis, personal notes. Uh, is this from the bottom to the top again? Yeah, we gotta start here, apparently. I finally found a quiet place for my family. We've been running from one settlement to the next, just trying to keep out of sight. Now that I'm on the other coast, I feel much safer. But then ants happened. The family across the way from us seems pretty decent. Their kid, Brian, likes to play with my son, which is great. It's hard for Will to make friends because we haven't stayed in one place long enough. Maybe we can finally put down some roots here in Great Itch. Yeah, about that. I was scavenging some of the nearby buildings for junk to sell and came across a working radio. No sooner did I turn it on than I heard the familiar patriotic anthems they used to play whenever Richardson would give a speech. But this was different. Who the hell is President Eden? When did that happen? Are they on this coast too? Most importantly, will they come looking for me? I hope this journey wasn't a huge mistake. What did you do that they would come looking for you? Some scientist named Lesko moved in with the w Wilkes family across the street. They are helping him make some sort of a structure on the old lot near the diner. Lesko offered to pay me caps if I helped, but I declined. I don't know who he's working for, but I don't think they're still looking for me. Our supplies are running low and I need to begin foraging for food and some better drinking water. I'd have an easier time if it wasn't for the damn ants. I swear they have a nest around here somewhere. Oh yes, oh yes they do. These ants are becoming a real pain in the ass, so much so that I had to take a trip to Megaton and buy a better gun to protect my family. It cost me a fall small fortune. I had to trade every bit of ant meat I had collected, but it was worth it. I'm teaching Frank and Sheila to use it just in case something happens to me. If one of you two are reading this and I'm gone, I keep the gun in the kitchen behind the old fridge. Thanks for telling me. I'm going to have to find a better way to protect Sheila and Will from those ants. Ever since Lesko came to town, I'm certain they're getting more and more aggressive. Uh -huh. Wasteland ants are bad enough, but at least you can run away from them. These would seem to pursue you to the ends of the earth if they could. Call me crazy, but I swear I saw one start a fire the other day. I don't know how this could happen. Could be happening even. I decided to dig up my old sidearm and keep it hidden on me at all times. If those things get too close, I'll blast the antenna right of their ugly heads. Because then they burn each other. I can't believe I went through all that trouble to leave Navarro and make my way across the country just to get stuck in this shithole. I'll be damned if I'm going to die here. Now that we're cut off from Lesko and Wilkes, I think we're on our own. The damn ants keep trying to find a way to get inside the house. Even as I'm typing this, I can hear them scraping the walls, looking for a way through. I don't know how much longer we can last. Well, um, you died. I'm gonna sleep in your bed now. Thank you for the bed. And now I would like- Oh, a bottle cap. 
Ooh, another bottle cap. Behind the fridge, huh? Can I make it? Eee. Caliber rounds, caliber pistol, which I also don't really use. Yet, I should say, because I'm sure I'll run out of bullets soon enough. But I need this guy's keys. So I need to actually find him. Which means I have to go outside, which is where the ants are, and they'll find me and they'll kill me. And I disagree with that, all of that. Vehemently, you might even say. It's all broken. No, nothing. You're hearing a dog in the background? It's not my dog, it's a dog outside. Door to abandoned home. Isn't that all of them? Yeah, I think that's all of them. I think that's, that's a very vague description of any house in this place. Ooh. This is quite certainly the angriest dog ever. Gun, guns and bullets? What are you? Where would you be if you were? Oh, maybe here. Because Grognak is here. That's another magazine, but we're, we were going to save those, weren't we? We were going to save those in, in case we actually get a perk for those. Because I haven't actually checked that, which is stupid. I should have probably done that first before reading any Grognag. But I read some Grognag. Shame on me. More bobby pins, more whiskey. Is there something behind the place? No? Because everyone seems to be hiding things everywhere. Take jet. Pre-war money. Lots of pre-war money. Literally under the bed. <laughs> Oh, that is, that is so ancient. Okay, well, you didn't have too much, but, oh, I say that. But you had a comic book, and that is really all I need in this world. The world may be lost forever, but as long as I still have comic books, I think I'll be okay. I think I'll be okay. See... That professor was supposed to live with the guy. So does that mean that there's like a way out here somewhere? That leads to the professor? Because, I mean, that would make sense, wouldn't it? I did already ransack this place, but I also feel like it was the only place... Hmm. Professor! Where do you live? They did say on the other side. So that you should be here. Maybe it's in this... This rickety thing. Can you even open that? Door to recently built shack. And apparently I have a key for that. Oh, this is 100% where the professor lived. What were you doing here, professor? Were you experimenting on ants? I believe that you were. You don't weigh anything, so I will take that. A Braxo cleaner? What does that do? What does a Braxo cleaner do? Medex. Do you even do anything? Maybe you're just... Are you just this? Oh, you are. Well, then I don't want you because you weigh something and I don't want things that weigh anything. But where is everyone's corpses? Did they just take Dr. Lesko's password recording? Note added. Password recording. Re recording? Recording. So, oh yeah. This could be the fifth time I've forgotten the code to my desktop terminal. I really must learn to be more organized. The password for my terminal is Formesidai. How hard could that be for me to remember? Note to self. Destroy this holotape as soon as move to new lab is complete. Okay then. For Macedite, or whatever that is. He does sound like a bit of a nutty professor, doesn't he? So I can open this then. Yeah, because I already heard about it. Good for me. 
Please do not access without permission. Yeah, well, you know. I'm not gonna activate this yet. Where did I go wrong? Uh, is this from bottom to top again? Yeah. Batch A27 is a complete failure. I must return to my original formulas and begin the process all over again. Perhaps the pressure of working in these conditions without proper labor laboratory equipment is to blame. Perhaps I simply didn't splice the correct genetic instructions. Or perhaps I am fatigued. Whatever the case may be, A27 is proving to be a disaster. I must introduce a new formula soon, or I may not be alive to see my hypothesis, hypothesis come to fruition. So the ants already got to him then. I found the perfect specimen for my... Oh, that updated something. Remove the source of the fire ants. Hmm. I found the perfect specimen for my experiments inside Marigold Station, which I guess is where we need to go. I set up shop underground for now while I prepare the experiment. All I need is a bit of last minute programming on my robot and it will be ready to perform the delicate injections. Soon I will prove to everyone that my formula is a viable alternative to the destruction of these misunderstood beings that kill people all the time. I realize the dangers involved in tampering with nature. I've heard the rhetoric and the hoopla about playing God. However, I am determined to reduce these poor things back to their original state when they were harmless. Only through genetic recoding is this possible. All that is needed is a proper test subject. My search continues as I tweak the formula. So it doesn't even... he doesn't mean to be evil. He just kind of is. Robot out of range. Pot empty. Yeah, I suppose that would be a thing. Added. Dr. Dr. Lesko's notes. Empty suitcase. So he took the robot with him then. While I take your bottle caps with you. So we also have to go to Marigold Station. And probably find his corpse. That just seems to happen a lot. Oh, no, actually do that. Oh, and I double tap it. Because of course, oh god. There's an ant there. Where do I have to go? Is it there? Do I have to go there? No, I have to go here. Here, please. Yes. And I'm gonna not go to the fire end. I'm going to go away from the fire end. Um, also kind of towards the fire end. Oh god, they will see me. Maybe not. Maybe I'll take a little walk around instead. Considering they would otherwise follow me to the ends of the earth. And I... You know what? I don't feel like being followed to the end of the earth. And there's another one. And another one. And there are far too many of these. And I can't wait until I've destroyed their nest. Because this is getting ridiculous. Oh my god. And I hear them everywhere. I actually hear them everywhere. Oh god. Oh god. I'm gonna go in here instead. I hope they don't actually follow you in here. Because that's ridiculous. Oh, you can probably hear that. There are so many. And there's gonna be a ton more here. You know what I need in my life? A shotgun. Is what I need in my life. Are you normal? Oh, you're not. You're a fire ant worker. Don't fire at me. Just only die. Oh, I'm gonna make sure I kill all of them. Oh, actually my... Oh, it's full. I should sell some of that Nuka Cola. I haven't used any just yet. I should reload. I should get my my points back too. Ugh, the sound is just disturbing. Oh God, I can't see a thing. But let's do a thing anyway. There, I've crippled your head. I'm still kind of on fire though. So there's definitely ants behind this, because you can hear them. Which means we're not going there yet. Oh god, that's a big one, isn't it? Yes, it is. Gotta murder that antenna. Is that, is that me saying that? Oh god, I believe it is. See, for this... Is that other one coming too? Yes, it is. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, no, actually, you know what? That's fortunate. I'm gonna say that's fortunate. 
Okay, wait. Don't, don't open your mouth. And instead, simply die. But not quite die? But just crash the game instead. Definitely crash the game. And my controller is now just so angry with me for that. I'll be right back. Okay, and here we are again. Uh, unfortunately, we only got one ant along this time. And I actually kind of need two. So that's unfortunate. I'm gonna attack his other antenna this time. Oh no, I can actually just do both apparently. But my aim's not quite getting there, which is unfortunate. But I need the other ant so they can be crazy together, but don't know. Oh, 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 you are a ant. You're just not the right ant for the job. <laughs> <clears throat> this is not the time for puns, Jonesy. It is always the time for puns. Always. But yeah, that, that makes everything very unfortunate because I do kind of want to check around here. Which means... Did it... Did it lose track of me? I'm gonna have to go this way. Duh, that hurts my face. And find another set of fire ants. Or, like, at least a fire ant, because... Well... I need them to fight each other. Hello, ant soldier. Follow me. Come on. Come on! Hello? Oh my god! Don't be that way! I don't think it wants me to enter. I don't think I can set them up to fight each other either. Which makes everything unfortunate because it's gonna cost me so much. Oh, 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 I did that thing again. Um, No, I will use a stim pack because I can actually. Do you cost weight? Oh, you do. You know what? I should use you in that case. There, delicious purified water. Oh, we're gonna kill you then. Oh, this looks great! What does happen when I kill your antenna and there's no one around? You are now frenzied. Which means absolutely nothing that helps me. Just nothing at all. They... They actually stay in their place. That is unfortunate. I cannot have them fight each other. Oh god. Yeah, that was gonna happen, wasn't it? Oh, oh, now you want to come along. Yeah, I bet you do. This is unfortunate for my health. I'm gonna drink a lot of water. Water is healthy, clearly. No, but I want to. Wait. Hey, your antennas are dead. Why do you still have them? Now I wish to attack your head. Is that not a... Hello? Hello, head? Thank you. Leaving? Leaving. You should, you should go and find your other friend. He would love some company. Uh, I see you're still moving. Ah, yeah, you don't see me now, do you? Please die. I don't want his head to be... Cr yeah, that, what, that's the kind of crippling that I need. But my ammo is not in favor of any of this. Wait. Where's this ant gone? Where is this ant? Where is this ant go- Well, that is a magical ant, and um, it's going to pop up somewhere in Castavada Kedavra, and I'll probably be dead. That does not make me too happy. Carton of cigarettes. That weighs quite a bit, but it's also very expensive. I need that. Grady's last recording. What's Grady recording? If you 
you're listening to this tape, then my brains are splattered all over a wall somewhere, and you've got a job to do. You need to retrieve the package and get it safely to Ronald Lauren and Gertershade. Tell them Grady sent you. To get the package, you'll need the key. I've stashed it inside an old fire hose case in some maintenance closet in Marigold Metro Station. The key will unlock the safe that contains the package. Look for the room marked by a spinning light. You can't miss it. Good luck. And hopefully, they won't find you too. The room marked by a spinning light. I guess you were a Grady at one point. With your little lunchbox. <laughs> you actually brought a lunchbox. That guy's gotta eat, I guess. Ashtray, dart. Some decent loot here, though. I appreciate that. Foggy bottom. <laughs> oh, so I am actually at Men Metro Central. Or, no, I'm not. I'm at Marigold, aren't I? Pretty sure I am. So I can, from here, I can actually walk all the way over. And thus, this means that it's blocked off, which maybe it does. Probably a good chance that that's what it means. Oh well. I tried, you might say. Eh, it does seem pretty locked off here already, doesn't it? That's some serious- oh no, I can probably actually walk. Can I walk through there? I probably can. I'm gonna say that I can. But is that actually where the ants are hiding? In which case, should I really want that? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I can walk all that way. And since I can teleport around anyway, I might as well check. I can always teleport back to Marigold. Yep, that's an ant. So I'm gonna say that's where the nest is. I'm gonna say that's where they're nesting, and then... Um, the lab where I just went away from? That's where Lesko is. Who is our resident crazy guy? Who we need to residently shoot in the face, probably. I don't know, maybe, maybe we can talk to him. Oh! Oh, that's, that's our magic ant! That's our magic ant! Hello, magic ant. I do not have enough bullets for this. That critical strike does not get me anywhere. Oh god! I don't do a whole lot of damage, do I? I really don't. I'm gonna take a med thing. No, wait, you know what? I'm not. Because maybe there's a bed. And I would like a bed instead. He's gonna come my way now. Okay, I have four points again. Wait. Wait, what? What? Where did he... He's going down there, is he? He is! That's where he went off to last time. I mean, I know that makes sense now that I say it, but... I'm, I'm just not that good at putting connections together, clearly. Yeah, you're expensive, but you're not a pack of cigarettes expensive. Frag mines are definitely... Oh, and I'm completely overburdened again. Well, that's unfortunate. What can we throw away? Or, better yet, what can we fix? We have another one of these pistols. And I can't use you to repair, but what about this one? I can use you to repair. Maybe I should start using this one for a bit. I mean, the damage is lower... Obviously, but then I can fix it later. Which is good. That one's locked. Pack of cigarettes. I'm gonna open you. Yes, I will. Yes, I will. With more frag mines and then I'm overburdened again because that's how that works. Ah. Repellent stick. Oh no, I needed that. I needed that for a quest. Chinese assault rifle. Hmm. It weighs a ton, but it's also expensive. Huh. Assault rifles just kind of... They're kind of heavy. 
Hmm. I definitely want to keep that, because it looks like it's important somehow. However, I don't need... No, I do need science. I, I, I need science in my life, clearly. What don't I need? Food sanitizer is unfortunately very, very heavy. You know what? No, I'm going to slowly go to my aunt. And I'm going to murder him. And then I'm going to fix this. And then I'll have some room again. That's how that's going to happen. Oh god, there's two of them. Why? You're not really surprised, are you, Junzi? You shouldn't be. Okay, I'm going to instead... Wait, you're a worker, though. You're not strong. I crippled your head! I'm kind of sorry, but I'm also kind of not. Wait and let me kill you. Did I? Oh god! I don't think I did. No, wait, I did. I did. I killed it. I'm also on fire. Uh, not in the good, good way, either. Uh, I'll take some purified water. Ah! Take some purified water. And it'll be great. I'll do great. I'll be happy and healthy for the rest of my life. Because I can walk and run and jump and do all those things. The good things. Okay. We'll continue fight with a firefight. The firefight, the fire end. In the next episode. Um, I'll probably... Yeah, no, you know what? I have tons of bullets. I'll probably be alright. See you guys in the next episode. In a controlled environment first. Uh, you know what? I am shocked. I am shocked. Your knowledge of experimental procedure surprises me. Indeed, I have skipped a step and directly modified an entire brood. Perhaps I was too hasty. I was so certain it would work.